Hey there guys, uh, what's up? It's your boy George, back with another YouTube video for you guys on the channel. In today's video, we're taking a look at the new Wyatt 6 cards that have just dropped in WWE Supercard. So that being said, let's get right into the content. Right then, guys. The new Wyatt 6 cards are in WWE Supercard, as you guys can see from this. It is a collectible event, which is interesting, mainly because of the date. You guys see that? 12 days, 18 hours. Does that mean Season 11 is in... 13 days, basically in 12 days and 18 hours. It could be. Genuinely speaking, this could be the last big hurrah before season 11. This is so interesting. So, I mean, I want to go through the cards with you guys. You've got an Uncle Howdy. you got a Nikki Cross. you got a Joe Gacy. You've also got Eric Rowan. Cold. I love the design of these cards. I think they're so cold. You've also got a Dexter Loomis. Uh, we've already seen Joe Gacy and obviously Nikki Cross. These cards insane artwork again shout goes to cat that these cards are amazing but nonetheless you guys have also like i said the collectible event you can get the white six collectibles off the draft board i don't know if there's a limit to them i don't know about that but i know you can get off the draft board which is really really cool but yeah, like I said, 100 collectibles gets you a guaranteed white six card from the new No Better pack, which is awesome. You get them up to five times. So you could get either two, you could get basically, you could get all singles or you get like a pro, two pros, whatever. It's just the luck of the draw at that point. But you got to set them three packs for 75 collectibles, which features a lot of the SE cards of season 10, including the Liv Morgan one, which is bloody dope. I love that. Then you've also got the Reckoning Packs. 50 collectibles gets you a guaranteed Inferno tier card. 30 collectibles, we are here for a bonus chance of the Uncle Howdy. Also, not Uncle Howdy, White Six cards, as well as uh, three cards from Tundra to Inferno. Then you've got um, five collectibles, gives you 25 draft picks, and obviously one for Super Coin. So I'm going to do my research on this. I'm going to see if it's unlimited uh, collectibles off the board each day, because if it is, follow up video with how to get unlimited Super Coin, yada, yada, yada. You guys know the spiel will drop as well. But not only that, I'll have to come back later as well, because you got the November calendar dropping tonight. So I'll be back on the channel with that uh, content for you guys as well. But yeah, man, this stuff, this collectible event is so interesting because again, the new calendar comes out tonight. We don't know what's on the other side of this. We generally don't know what's on the other side of this 31 until 2 a.m. when they release the calendar. So I'm just ex as excited as you guys are. I just think this date with 12 days and 18 hours is something you guys need to mark down your calendars because I think that's when season 11 happens. It'll be either on that day or the day after. Like, we're not far out now. Because the thing is, if you look at that and then compare that to the Battle Pass that came out, the Charlotte Flair one, it's the same amount of time. So, I mean, there can't be any coincidence in that, in my opinion. For my opinion, there can't be any coincidence in that. So, based on that, Season 11, two weeks from now, let's get it running. So, with that being said, I hope you guys have liked this video. I hope you guys have found the, th uh, the, the, the date and the time as interesting as I have. But that being said, we're also trying to hit 3,200 subscribers on the channel by the end of the year. If we can get that, that'd be greatly appreciated. But that being said, I'll see you guys back on the channel later with the November calendar. Till then, 